What's up guys, so Mr. Consistent over here is uh, banging out videos all the time. And in fact, we might as well show you the flat now because you saw the last video and this is what we transformed into. Ignore this piece of shit, like this is washing stuff. Actually, don't ignore this shit. This is Hercules. There you go. We use code Josh Tanner. No, Josh, fucking code Josh. I check out. So yeah, this is the uh, the place now. So much better. Look at the aesthetic of this. We've got Rocket League on. A big posing mirror with obviously uh, some lighting. <sighs> Beautiful. My room's a bit of a mess, so I'm going to show that in a moment. You can see a little sneak peek. Honestly, everything stayed the same, but uh, how are we doing, Jack? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna say anything. I don't know, oh, did you ask me a question? No. This is how I I'm said, doing. So how are we doing, Jack? This is how I'm doing. <laughs> so I was, I was also going through my old videos, and this one is World's Q's Memphis Pure Gym six months ago. So we had no intention of obviously Jack moving to Worcester, but listen, look at this. And to say, what do you think of Worcester? Shit, oh. <laughs> what? I'm gonna do that. Jack is currently in the shithole breaking it down. I Steady rap. Do the Michael Jackson rap. What? Michael Jackson rap. <laughs> so moving in has been so eventful, but so lovely. I think it's been sick. It's been, training's been good. Uh, hopefully we're gonna get humongous, me and Jack together. Off, off the creatine and stuff. But um, I'm probably going to record some footage talking to you guys later because I'm going to make some chicken and whatnot. Uh, it's pretty late at night actually, so Jack's probably going to go to Betty Bye soon. He's going to have his beauty sleep. I'm going to tuck him in, give him a kiss goodnight, and then it'll just be me. But yeah, I'm going to cook some meals. We'll have a little talk because I've actually got a little stand here <coughs> next to the air fryer. Next to the air fryer, which I used to cook my chicken. Wonderful. All right, so Jack's binned off the idea of Betty Bye's, and uh, we're just going to throw food at people from our floor. And... Uh, we just find shit like this funny. Like this is this is our mature age of uh, 24 over here and 19, and we just do stupid shit like this. This speaker is on full fucking blast. The whole the whole street can hear us. Alright, so we literally found this random girl, like randomest girl, I don't know who it is. And we both sent her the same voice note, but Jack did mine, I did his. I'm Link Wagmar. I'm Link Wagmar. I'm Link Wagmar. I'm Link Wagmar. Peter Griffin. 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 Peter I think she will. Look at Jack's fade as well. Oh, fresh on that, yeah. They said a brother rock. I'm gonna start on this fun time. Also, guys, I'm actually standing on my own for the once ever now. And uh, this is the second video, well, the first video of 2023, but the second video back on my grind set. And uh, today I'm actually with Sam, my coach. So, Jack's down in Southampton, but I'm with a special guest. He's harassing the TV. I'm now playing Fortnite. He's playing Fortnite right now. In the big sense of us. So this is my condition at the moment. Obese. Under Sam's coaching. Prime obesity. Got me feeling. Got me feeling like Mr. Olympia right now. That's it. Obviously. It's me and Sam, so it's obviously going to be a leg session like normal. Like, there's no surprise there. It's always a leg session with me and Sam. We actually did the top line arms yesterday. And my doms in my fucking, my ball sack are absolutely killing me. I couldn't even see where I was. Hang on. What the fuck? So, uh, yeah, legs again today. But it's a good leg day. It's a, it's a proper leg day. So it'll be very exciting. Sam's legs just on another, another level of real. Size his hamstrings. My goodness, this man does not play around. This is why I want my big legs, because Sam, it's on the head legs later. Sam's also got a my protein bag. I've yeah. Did you use Ted, Ted Ten? Ted Ten, that was the one I used. <laughs> so obviously today's a pretty standard day. It's New Year's Day today, so there's not much going on in the city of Worcester. But, um, so yeah, me and Sam, we can get our meals in, relax a little bit. 
and oops what the fuck relax a little bit and then uh we'll try and get some footage we'll probably throw obviously i said to, i was gonna throw some pancakes with jack the other day but we never got around to it but there's our ammunition here but there's fucking nobody here so if you're lucky today we might nail someone in the fucking head with them there we go the room the room's looking all right i can't fucking speak today it got a pile it's like a towel and shit macbook tv all of that stuff and then the wonderful mirror the sex mirror of course which uh it's not even facing the bed. My phone's just down. All right, so about to go to the kitchen now. We, uh, we didn't do too much. We dosed around for a bit. We um, we pretty much just played Fortnite together. But uh, Sam's got me on the the pre. He's got my little potion over there with 50 grams of maltodextrin. It's five grams of creatine. And what would it be? Something, a certain amount of grams of EAAs. And my water, of course. It's going to be disgusting like that. What do you think, Sam? <laughs> um, what do you hate? Everybody, good I, but I love legs. That's all we care about. Sam wants to change his answer. What do you hate? Fat people. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so our lift has been, our lift got fucked and broke, so we're busy like emergency <laughs> things. So, you know, not ideal. It's slippy as shit. My knees are falling out, but it's gonna be a good touch. And my headphones are 10%. I love seeing little bro smile. You see VVs just listening. Her Jesus Christ from the witnesses. I'm a Turn me up, Kurt. Cruise control. So I'm one set of reduction in. And as you can probably tell by the video before. I have never felt trained like this. Like top line yesterday killed me off because of Sam. Like see, fixing my form and shit, and now it's fucking my uh, fucking my legs up again. I don't even know, I just let it hit Diamonds in my ear, but you like a deer I don't drink no beer, but I drink the liquor Diamonds on me, make the pussy way quicker I can make it black, bro, with a stick I've been fucking on his mama and his sister Put up with the gang, deep in the spread Coppin' on my guap, big ears, let him Wait, he gave me a paper cut I put the bitch in the back with a bubble But I made that money, you know what the fuck is up You know what the fuck is up I don't go around with a glocky, you know what's up Obviously, I think the answer is pretty clear. Me. So, 
Sam won, bastard. But I won on the second set. But uh, this has been the best leg I've had. It's very similar to the last video, if you've already watched it. But, but, keep watching, you fucking bastards. Yeah, I'm training with my coach. What's better to watch than me and my coach? And Jack, if he's here. <laughs> in the world. That was like the best constant stream of piss. <laughs> this is the best Hercules advertisement ever. See you up until next time. Next time, next time. But hopefully next time I'll come a bit longer because it's just so cool. More than likely. Because none, none of you are going to be on stage. Oh, by the way, it's not here, but like I said, you'll be on stage. So if you're, if you're not on stage, then you're so that is probably one of every time, every time the leg sessions get better. Obviously, with Mr. Coach Sam Lancaster, <laughs> the sessions just are impeccable. Fucking leg shaking like a shitting dog. We didn't record calves because, you know, I don't know how many people like watching calves. I think people are like, what the fuck? Like, people like watching the big sets. People don't want to see someone calf raising some stupid shitty weight. But the key is, do not be fat. That's the rules. Yeah, we don't like but fat people. What is wrong with this focus, bro? It's just not focusing. Like they done back home. What's the thoughts, Mr. Samuel? Um, Coach Sam? I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> this was the fucking most incredible session. I actually didn't, I didn't record like the best parts. So set two of hack, which is a madness. That muscle round of quad the muscle round of quad extension. Uh, the second set of leg press for both of us. Like, because I only record, I've only started to record the first set. Only because, like, you know, I don't want to prolong, like, a stupid amount of time for, like, a long video, if you know what I'm saying. I want to get straight to the point, so you see what I'm doing, and you see how I'm doing it without, you know, like, prolongating it. But, yeah, we missed the, uh, we missed some of the best things ever. But the pump was sick. Yeah, my legs are shaking still. That's pretty gay, my brother. So, I've got all this fucking shit to do, because it's my job. But, oh, yeah, have I even... Oh, my brother's dead. This morning. <laughs> it's not focusing out. When it focuses, I'm gonna. Oh, fuck. What's. There you go. Don't let it happen again. This is. Jack says I have to wash up, but look at the fucking job on this. This is. I literally just did this. And then just put it, put it in the thing. I hope to sort this out. I hope Jack doesn't watch this video. I hope he just skips past it because this is the most. This is the worst job I've ever done. Oh shit. I just, Oh, that's okay. Uh, Alright, my batteries are red, but it's half twelve at sin, which means people come out, therefore we throw stuff at people because it's funny. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> this devious man. You ready? <laughs> oh, wait, 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 wait. Just, just wait, wait till that. <laughs> Look how fat this piece is. <laughs> this is gonna hit someone's fucking face. <laughs> Alright, we've got a quiet spell. Just cut, cut the video. Cut the video. What? Why don't we go bottles or what? <laughs> Where are you going bottles so I can hit this? Alright guys, so I have just woken up. This is a few days, I don't even know what day it is, like I'm miles behind, but uh I need to make my meal too for work tomorrow. So you know what? You're gonna we're gonna talk and we're gonna make my meal too together. Also, so I haven't got a tripod at the moment because my other one broke, but I found my original one and this is the state of it. I don't know if you can see it. It's like lathered with like disgusting chocolate and like these keys, I don't even know where these keys are from. But I'm gonna go wash this up so I can put it on. Oh wait. Never mind, there's no fucking sockets to even plug them in, so fuck, fuck that then. I'll still just leave it there anyway, just so I can wash it up and clean it up and whatnot. Alright, you got it balanced on the microwave. This is me right now. Still lean as shit. But Sam is yeah, making sure I'm sticking to plan, so we're gonna we're gonna show Sam right now we're sticking to plan, basically. So no. Chicken breast fillets. Thank fuck for this air fryer. This cooks so fast. But you'll see how white I am. What the fuck? Focus. The bastards. So it's literally as simple as what you hear. I just cut it in the middle so it cooks nicer. I literally shake it around like that. That's it. And I just put them all in. And I'll show you. So all the chicken breasts in there. Simple as that. Bang the time wrong. I don't spice or anything because I am white. It's actually just more due to the fact that I cannot be fucking bothered to put any spice on it. I literally just, just dump it in. Simple as that, what the fuck. And then, all I do now, is I go into here, get my rice, put it in the microwave. It is literally that simple. Pack it that, 200 grams of chicken, and that is my meal done. You'll see obviously later on, but let me just tie this shit up. I always wear a hood in my videos, although I've got the fresh trim right now. Oh dear, never mind. So while the chicken cooks, I'll be washing up. There's a lot to fucking do. There we go. Uh, I was gonna actually have a little chat with you, but then I tried a video, the tap was running, couldn't I hear a fucking thing I'm saying. So, I'm gonna do the washing up. The chicken should be ready by the time I'm done. I'll have my meal five in my fucking lap, and we'll speak to you then. How simple is that? It'll probably be on the next slide. All right, so I actually forgot I was in a cooking show, so here is the chicken. The driest, Looking chicken. Actually, it looks really juicy, actually. You know what? It's valid. They go out and say, fuck you, guys. Oh. <laughs> <coughs> I just start recording and that happens. So, what I like to do literally just pick them out and just put them in this. Like, it's on the scales right now, so I just have just literally as fast as this. Just pick them up. Bosh. Sorted. There we go. Get the fuck off, you bastard. And that and the scales weren't on, but uh, simple as that. I'm just gonna let me check they're cooked now, like properly, and then if they are, so that's cool, then put them in the fridge. There we go. You cannot tell me that this is not some juicy, you can actually see it dripping. That is like some juicy ass chicken, juicy pink asshole porn video, but it's just bland, that's all it is. Like, it's not that I'm boring, it's that I'm lazy. Alright, guys. So here with my meal five. Josh's last thought of the day, just obviously to finish the YouTube video off. I've been in this apartment for a month. And I think that mindset of me getting my own apartment was not for the better, it was actually for the worse. Because I was like, damn, I'm not a university. I'm 19 years old and I've got my own place. Damn, I am the shit. 
I don't need to do anything. That was my thinking, no fucking joke. People, like, you don't think like that originally. You don't go, I didn't go in December when I moved in there, oh, I'm the fucking shit. No, I didn't think like that. But it's like a secondary thing in my head that's like, you know, you don't have to do this. You don't have to, you don't have to work. Not work as in like YouTube, any like socials, which I fucking didn't do. The whole point of this place is so, it's like content heaven. I live with my best fucking friend and I can get anything I want. I can record anything. But no, I sat back like a fucking idiot and just relaxed because I thought I was, you know, sat, I was satisfied with this. And obviously this is a beautiful, beautiful place. Humongous in real life. Like it's so much bigger in person, everyone says it. And I just, I, yesterday, I had a, a massive, massive talk with Jack. And this is why it's so important to have such a fucking incredible friend who will tell you how it is while being supportive, not shitting on you, while being supportive, like telling you, damn, he needs to tighten up. What the fuck are you playing at? Which is what happened, because yesterday, Jack says to me, oh, you got the YouTube video finished. Like, he's such a good fucking friend, such a good friend. This guy's, like, reminding me. He shouldn't be reminding me, but he is. Do you know what I mean? Like, that's why, that's why I really kicked into my head, like, damn, you are a fucking loser. And I always will be a loser if I just live the life that I'm living. What I'm doing right now, oh, I wake up to go to work. A job I don't even like. But it, it'll do. You know what I mean? I'll go home. Oh, it's just the rest of the day. I'll go to the gym, obviously. But uh, it's either work, gym, and then do nothing. Like, what? This nothingness is ridiculous. Like, I'm doing fuck all to improve myself outside of work. And this is what really got me yesterday. I'm waffling, but I'm going to cut this video up. I am working right now. And a lot of you are. Don't you fucking lie. A lot of you guys and myself, we're working for, the, for a, a person. We work for a company. We work for a person who owns a company. Where is that person right now? That motherfucker's on a yacht in like the Mediterranean, relaxing his fucking ass off as I'm doing all the work. I'm not benefiting in any way. I get paid, but yeah, I'm doing my fucking job. It's like you do work, you get paid. I have no ownership of anything that I make. So where, where, this is, you know, I, I can't even explain this shit. It's so fucking hot, like annoying. I am fucking benefiting nothing because it's not my own. This YouTube channel is my own. Like, this is my YouTube channel. I'm not having fucking, like, Jeff Bezos, like, own my YouTube channel. I know he doesn't own fucking Google, but that's just, like, an example. He doesn't... That motherfucker doesn't own it. But when, like, I am in control of my content, I, I could post this whole video. I could post a video of me, like, wanking. And that is still my content. Like, I still made that, and it is mine, and it belongs to me. But... I'm making parts for uh, somebody uh, like a, a furnace. That's not mine. I'm just dealing with it. Do you know what I mean? I'm I'm the shit worker. You know, you should be accepting the shit worker. Like this is what I was accepting. Like yesterday, like, for the whole month, I was like, damn, I'm the shit worker. But I didn't think like that. I just thought, oh, yeah, I'm doing my job. No, I need to I need to dig deeper than that. Like you want to have a fucking, you know, right now if I want to go on holiday, first of all, I have the money. Even worse, I have to write a holiday form, request it, and potentially get denied. You know, because where I work, there's only four of us, and we can only have one off at a time. And in summer, obviously, the fucking bigger guys, like the uh, the leaders, they take their time off first. So then, where does that leave me? What I get rejected for my holiday that I wanted to book all the summer. So what do I, I have? Nothing, and I'm still working for the guy on the yacht. But no, if I do this. Like YouTube, if I do something, I actually, you know, I can, it's, it's not hard to do, it's, it's, it's like a simple task, which I've just been putting off, I'm a fucking idiot. But I'd rather be, oh, I see a video of like a holiday, yeah, you want to go there, Jack? Yeah, fuck it, we'll go for the week. How fucking good does that sound? Like this fucking, this shit, I like work with someone is not it. And I'm surrounded by business owners, my coach Sam, Sam is working his fucking ass off. He works and he's coaches on top. This is the busiest man alive. And he's still, you know what I mean? He still found time to enjoy himself. He still found time to come down. You see, he, he came down. He didn't have to, but he did. I got Jack, who owns a fucking beautiful brand, which I'm, I wear every single day of my life, like every day. And you know, he's a business owner. He, he's done the shit. He's done the hardest bit. And I just, I just felt really stupid that day, like when Jack spoke to me about this, because I felt like I was just a lazy fucking piece of shit. 
you know. It's not like what I'm doing is actually like the hardest thing ever. No, it's not. It's just I didn't have the mindset for it. You know, maybe you can take that home yourself. Like, you're watching this, if you're still watching it. Like, you are... You're probably in a very fucking similar similar situation where you, you could be doing something. But you're just, you're just sitting around. Like, you're, you're scrolling through Instagram. You could be doing something a little bit better. And I'm not here to fucking lecture you. Like, I'm the laziest twat ever as well. I had a, I had a nap before I, I hopped on this because I had, like, two hours sleep. But take something from this because what the fuck else are you doing? You're, you're watching me. Because, but look, I'm actually educating you right now so you can watch me. But, like, stop watching, like, porn. Stop fucking watching girls shaking their ass on Instagram. Stop watching some stupid fucking bullshit. Like, do you know what I mean? Or when you do, just make sure you've done your fucking work beforehand. Because I wasn't doing that. And, you know, it's been a day. So I'm not going to act like the fucking messiah, as Jack said to me yesterday. But, uh, you know, take something from this and just put a little bit more into something you want to do. Don't always work for some fucking guy on the yacht. Because that really fucking hit me hard yesterday. Like, I got proper in my feels about it, thinking like, damn, what the fuck is my life going to be if I keep doing this shit? I'll be working for the guy on the yacht for the rest of my life. And would I want that? No, I fucking do not.